Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I hope you are doing well. I am coming to you with a message for the sign of cancer. If you have cancer placements, chances are this could resonate with you. Please bear in mind, cancer, that not every message will always be for you. So do not take any message that does not fit. Okay. If you are new here, welcome. If you are returning, I'm very, very grateful to have you here, Cancer. Let's take a look and see what Spirit wants you to know at this time. Please flip the rolls as you need to, as I may be picking up on your energy, but I could be picking up on somebody else's energy in your environment, okay? So use your discernment. Messages for Cancer, please. We have the owl, number 23, and fawns. There are spiritual messages and great wisdom to be found during this period of transition. Fawns, weathering the challenges ahead, will bring through a new positive future. Right. Some of you could be cycling through something difficult here, Cancer, but I see you being, I'm seeing spiritual upgrade energy. Whatever it is that you may be going through at this time could be pretty tumultuous. You could be feeling as though, you know, are you going to even get out at the other side? But I definitely see some sort of wisdom that you're going to be getting from this. Luck, you are right to be strong and optimistic about the opportunities ahead. Definitely, yeah. Remain focused, remain positive as you're going to get a really good outcome through whatever this is at the other end. Some of you, you've gone through quite a difficult time. And it's time for you to persevere and get out at the other end. Number 16, the lion. Harness the loyal, protective aura of the lion. Charge ahead ma magnificently. Yeah. Keep your strength. Keep your faculties about you. Because things are about to change. Your luck is about to change. Dragonfly. Have confidence during this time of great joy renewal and connection to spirit i definitely see you becoming more spiritually enlightened some of you could be getting downloads at this time and this could be showing you um a way forward okay so definitely watch out for signs synchronicities that you could be seeing feeling hearing watch out for your dreams as well but you're definitely be, being guided i'm not going to say that this is not a rocky situation or you may be experiencing difficulty in some way shape or form it's prickly okay it's definitely prickly but i definitely see something changing and you being better for it at the other end is what i'm seeing here some of you could have fire in your chart strongly messages for cancer specifically leo with that lion and the fawns card i'm getting leo energy as well leo energy yeah the sun card you're actually manifesting happiness here i'm hearing the only way is through messages for sign of cancer ten of pentacles Ten of Pentacles. For a lot of you, if you've been going through some sort of hardship, I see you being in a more stable position after this. For some of you, you could have taken a knock to your um, stability in some way. King of Wands in the reverse. Yeah, your confidence in your stability, in your grounding, okay? In just your tangible items, you know, stability in general. This could be about your home, where you lay your head. This could be about your tangible things money you know longevity in terms of stability as well i see you you're restoring your confidence in this or this will be restored by spirit here this is just for cancer some of you definitely could be dealing with a fire sign three of pentacles for some of you you could be getting a promotion at your job i'm getting yeah this is a new venture here something that you're going to be able to um renew your passion in OK, for some of you, if you've been feeling a little bit lethargic, a little bit lack, lackluster is what I'm getting. I see you getting some sort of um, energetic um, boost. OK, King of Cups, the Hierophant. For some of you, you definitely have new love here. Some of you can have an option between two people, even two of Pentacles. Do you know what I see, Cancer? Take it as it resonates. This could be you. This could be somebody else. Six of Wands. Yeah. 
success is coming for you cancer i'm seeing that potentially you could be juggling people in the future okay i'm definitely seeing that i'm definitely seeing you becoming you know more grounded within self again i'm getting spiritual upgrade you know becoming wise self mastery okay at whatever this is there's definitely an energy of you working on yourself. Some of you could be definitely working on your confidence here. But I definitely see that coming through, coming to pass for you. Because whatever it is that you're cycling through at this time, I feel like you're going to be in a position where you're going to actually see that there's going to be big changes that are going to be pushed through for you. With the page of wands, I see you kind of going back to basics you're going to be finding your passion again in possibly something to do with your work something that you're going to be able to get stuck into with the three of pentacles and the ace the um, page of wands there for some of you you've got a new project that you're starting up something that's in the beginning stages and i see it becoming bigger here with that ten of pentacles as well and the hierophant card there's some sort of elevated energy that is coming forth for you here cancer You've got the King of Cups and the King of Wands, literally one on top of the other here, okay? For some of you, you've definitely got a choice between two people, okay? That could be coming up in the future as well. For some of you, you may be a bit guarded. And this may be because you may be trying to make a decision between two people. Some of you could be dating two people. And you are trying to make some sort of decision about who to collaborate with and who to work with, who is going to give you, bring you the most success, where you're going to be most happy. And with that justice card, definitely, you're not going to be telling these two people about the other until you make a definitive decision as to where to invest. Four of Wands is here. And we've also got the Six of <laughs> Pentacles. OK, this is you deciding which direction to go. Also got the six of wands. Yeah, you want to make the best decision that's going to be for your higher self. You're going to choose somebody who's going to be elevating you with the hermit card, six of swords. Somebody who you're going to be able to have peace with is what I'm getting. But you've got a choice here to make. A lot of you will choose to date two people until you decide who it is that you're going to be going for or what avenue you want to take. Just be careful that you're not um all these cards were stuck i didn't even see i didn't even take these cards that's fine nothing is by accident just be careful that you're doing things in the right way and then you're not stringing along people and you let everybody know what they need to be knowing in the situation because that's where we accumulate negative karma when we do that when we mislead people let's see pathway yeah there's definitely a way that's being shown to you. You see with that Fawns card, okay? Whatever it is that you're going through at this time, a way is going to be made clear to you, okay? If you've been going through a tricky time, I see that changing for you here. For some of you, you're going to be finding um, solace in some sort of new relationship as well. I definitely see that. Thoughts, okay? Interesting. The lovers talks about a choice. You want to make the best choice for you. For some of you, you're thinking about marriage at this time. You're thinking about stability, family, okay, possibly children here. That could be what your line of thinking is, okay, in terms of this new pathway that you want to be going down, making sure you make the right choice. I def definitely get a strong energy cancer of you wanting to make the right choice of partner here. So some of you official person, most definitely, okay. Choosing a person who is going to be aligned for you. Choosing somebody um, that is not going to leave you in a state of lack. For some of you, you've gone through some sort of hardship with a person in the past. Message of concern and poverty. Okay. Definitely. And, I, and for some of you, this could be still dwindling in the back of your mind. And this could be what the difficulty has been for you. Cycling through a relationship that may not have been for you. May not have been aligned for you something that may have been very prickly something that was hard to navigate and i see you definitely worrying about repeating a past mistake as well so try not try not to dwell on that too much concern absolutely dwelling on past situations past mistakes and i feel like that's why you're in a this defensive energy as you're distancing yourself from the past or something that was um quite tricky in the past house is here some of you could have had to have moved Okay, some of you could be moving or had to move 
away from a relationship you could have had a shared house with somebody i see you in a very guarded energy while you make this decision but i definitely feel like you desire love for a lot of you you want love for some of you i feel like as you become more stable in terms of your finances in terms of your stability long term i see love taking like a center stage in your life where you're going to be desiring togetherness you're going to be desiring something that is solid okay and a lot of you are thinking long term a lot of you are thinking long term at this time tell me some more for cancer knight of pentacles eight of pentacles a lot of you are working hard here and consistently hard at, at this as well i feel like you've got the right attitude in terms of you working through some sort of difficulty here for some of you it's a financial hardship that you've been going through wheel of fortune okay there's definitely a shift that's trying to happen for you four of pentacles a lot of you could be holding your money a lot of you could be going through some sort of struggle times at the moment which is a need for you to hold your money, save your money, okay? If you're not doing so already, if that's not you, then there could be a need for you to hold your money back until you become more stable here. A lot of you could be working really hard at something specific, okay? Again, I get that energy of you juggling. Six of pentacles giving to two while you decide who you want to choose here. There's definitely a choice. The moon, yeah, there's a choice that's coming up where you're possibly going to be hopping into the unknown and you're, you might come up against some sort of choice where you don't know what to choose. Strength card. Some of you, it's a Leo Emperor. You are definitely in control, whoever this is, with, with these options here. It's going to be hard for you to make a decision. And I definitely think it's due to what you've invested in in the past and things that may not have worked out for you. But I definitely see you being in the driver's seat because we've got the strength card and the emperor. And we've also got the seven of pentacles. You're going to be in the driving seat in terms of what to invest in, okay, for it to grow for you. I see you having choices. I definitely see you having options. I see a little bit of dwelling of the past and things that may not have gone right, but I see definitely that the wheel is turning in your favour. If there was difficulty, if you were betrayed, if you went through a situation where you couldn't navigate something with an individual in the past, I see a shift happening due to your ability to hold hold some sort of holding pattern of you being consistent working hard a lot of you could just be focused on your money and as i say i feel like the priority on stability is going to kind of dwindle not to say you're not still going to be working consistently to kind of be stable save your money come to a place where you are you know creating some sort of balance for your life stability wise i see love taking some sort of front seat as you are presented with two options here, okay, and you're going to have to make a choice as to where to invest, I see the choice being yours here, Cancer, two more on this, Queen of Cups, the lovers, yeah, this is what I'm telling you, this is about love, choice in love, choice on where to invest, okay, choices on where to invest for your Ten of Cups, I cannot make it up, bottom of the deck is the ten of cups so i just feel like right now you could be focused on your work your money your projects there's something that's got your creative juices flowing possibly a new project in work and as you kind of become more stable and you cycle through from some sort of difficulty in the past i see luck being on your side with the wheel of fortune and the luck and you're actually going to be thrown into a situation where you're going to have the option between two people potentially even more you could have three people even because we do have an emperor energy here as well could be an aries could be a water sign here could be a taurus you could be dealing with a leo of a um sagittarius or an aries as well cancer or a fellow cancer like yourself strong leo here strong gemini as well could be any sign but those are the ones that are sticking out to me here and i see that as you kind of put love as at the forefront of whatever it is i feel like you're going to be making a decision about where to invest and you're going to be torn a little bit due to your past okay for some of you you may date two people to decide 
but just make sure be careful with that um that you're not accumulating any negative karma for yourself by juggling or you know stringing anybody along make sure everybody is aware of what is going on and you'll be okay i like this for you cancer that is what i have for you if you like how i read please like share and subscribe to the channel cancer but until next time i will see you soon you take care bye